Hey guys, Nari here again. Uh, just a quick apology. I'm sorry I haven't been so consistent with these videos. I lost a little bit of motivation, you know, just kind of waiting for parts and stuff. But I was excited, you know, I was like, you know what? You know, I got, I got these parts here, you know, why not throw them on? I'm, I'm eager to drive the car already, you know, I want to go wash it and stuff, just I'm tired of seeing it sit here. I want to drive it to work, you know, start driving it a bit, get it, and then get you guys that review on that, on that short ship, which will, that'll be another video. But yeah, guys, uh, it's something simple, nothing too complicated, just radiator hoses. I got mine from HPS, this is their silicone, it's supposed to be better for keep, or keeping temperatures low. And obviously the Mishimoto radiator, and yeah, it's not too bad of an install. I'll kind of give you guys an idea. I'll take out the radiator itself and show you exactly what I'm taking off, and then I'll, I'll give you guys an idea in the engine bay as well. All right, guys, let's, let's get to it. All right, guys, as far as tools go, nothing complicated, just a 12 mil, 10, and then an eight. The eight is for the bands that come with the, uh, coolant hoses i want to say if it's not an eight then you should be fine with the 10 and that might be that might be an eight or just a flat screwdriver either or and then just some pliers to basically grab onto these and just take them off the clamps for the, the old radiator hoses freaking be um but yeah also just uh i just like to mention you know please disconnect your battery because we do have our alternator right there and then the other clamp is right there Last thing I need is for you to, you know, uh, close the circuit and you get shocked or fry something. So just disconnect it for safety reasons. One other thing I really like about this, as far as this platform, guys, look. So I want to, obviously I drained the uh, radiator already, but I don't know if you can see right here. This piece right there. This is the drain for the block itself. So I can get, try to get as much coolant as out, as much coolant out as I want to. So I'm gonna do that, and while that's draining, I'll disconnect the hoses, pull the radiator out, and you know, boom. We'll get this one set up, it's pretty simple. I think I'm gonna put the fans after, because I thought about putting the fans together with it, but I might be, I might be, uh, it might block me from connecting that hose and basically closing that, uh, this drain valve right here. Hey guys, let me get to it.
see those those that hole and that hole down there that's basically where you that where the radiator sits so it's one right there's a little pin right here and there's one right here and the old one should have came with rubber bushings and they are right here just pull them out put them on the new one The hardest thing was just to kind of like get it in there with that hose connected. I kind of went like at an angle. It wasn't too bad after that. Just be very careful, guys, because you know, this stuff's aluminum. The last thing you need is to, you know, end up breaking it. It's not too bad. It looks good. All right. Look at him. He's sleeping. Man, this guy's a little lazy. That's what he does all day. But anyways, let's get back to the video.
it back together. Not too bad of a job. You know, I'd say about 20 minutes. That's, just, that's what it took me. Other people take longer. Other people don't take as long. Next thing, I'm going to just top it off. So we'll take off the cap itself. Put that funnel in. Uh, keep adding uh, our coolant and water until the um, until basically I bleed out all the air. Make sure the fan operation is good. And after that, go for a test drive. Alright. Alright guys, I got the car running. Just waiting for those fans to kick in. Uh, I gotta keep an eye on my temps. So so far it's right there. It's not bad. Just I'm letting it warm up. Just make sure whenever you guys do anything cooling system, take out all the air, which is what I'm doing. This is the highest point. All right, guys, we're pretty much all set. The fans just kicked on a couple seconds ago. I got this. I got this on. I cleaned up a bit, topped off the reservoir. My temperatures have been consistent. Right there, and we're pretty much all done, guys. Uh, you know, hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe. All right, guys, Maui out. Peace. Oh.